Listen to what I'm going to tell you today. Everyone goes through shit. Everyone starts somewhere. Everyone fucks up. Everyone makes mistakes. It's always up to you whether you want to be average or a fucking champion. Stop approaching life with hesitation. Break the rules, stop conforming, and show this world who the fuck you really are. If you don't believe in what you're doing and have a true passion for what you are doing with your life, pack your shit up and go the fuck home. Never let closed-minded people tell you you can't do something. Fuck them, keep grinding, and keep moving forward. All the pain I've been through pushed me to be a stronger motherfucker every single day. Do something that matters to you. Do something you love and go after it as if your life depends on it. As if you're about to take your last fucking breath. When you have an opportunity, you have to take it. I'm not one of these fitness personalities that gets paid to work out and live a quote, fit lifestyle. My life does not consist of eat, sleep, train. There's no film crew following me around. I have a career that consumes the majority of my time, on top of the daily time-consuming tasks that everyone else has. I'm a real person with a real job, real problems, real stress, and real distractions. My life is full of the same fucking excuses you have not to train or eat the way that you should. I hear it all the time, I don't know how you do the things you do and find the time to do it. 90% of the time that comes from somebody who was belly up to a fucking bar the night before. Somebody needs to get your priorities in order, or stop complaining that you don't look or feel the way that you do, or you can just talk shit about the people that are doing it to make you feel better about yourself. If you want something, you can do it. You can be whatever the fuck it is you want to be. Everybody's got to work for where they're at. You don't just fucking wake up one day and become successful. It takes years of developing a skill and your craft to be a better fucking person at whatever it is you choose to do in life. Everybody can walk around and blame everybody else for the fucking things they haven't accomplished in life. You gotta fucking go through life with a go-getter fucking attitude and you want something, you fucking take it. You gotta fucking earn your stripes. You can't just walk through life thinking that everything's gonna be fucking handed to you. want to fucking impress me get out there and go get something go make something yourself the most important thing is that you have a vision that you have a goal because without that vision and without that goal again you're drifting around and you're never gonna end up anywhere people don't become successful just by accident sit down take your time instead of thinking about why do you want to work out what is your goal have the specific goal of what you want to accomplish because then you never go to the gym and you say the day I feel down a little bit I don't know what it is all about I don't know my life I'm confused no Never ever think small. If you're going to accomplish anything, you have to think big. You have to go and shoot for the stars. The biggest challenge most people have is because they think small. And the reason why people think small and why they choose small little goals is because they're afraid to fail. They know that if you shoot for a big goal, then the chances of failing are very high. And they're afraid of failing is one of the most common things why people are frozen and why they can't make a move in life because they're scared of failing. I say to myself, hey, I'm not worried about failing because that's part of life. You're not gonna be, go and win everything. And how far can you fall? Look at this, this is the ground. That's as far as I can fall. And you know something? That the only time you really consider the failure is if you fall 
and you don't get up. But if you get up, you never consider the failure. So I never considered myself a failure. I always considered myself a winner, even though I fell every so often. But I always got up and I always moved forward. If you do something, then go all out and do it well. Never accept the limitations of someone else. Somebody told you that it's impossible. Don't even try. Give up. Never accept the goddamn limitation. Focus. Don't get comfortable, motherfucker. You must focus. Necessity of growth. Be comfortable with being uncomfortable. There's a saying it's good to be a dreamer, but it's better to be a planner and a worker. There are two kinds of people in life there are dreamers, and there are those I call the risk takers. Today, if I will tell you the difference between a dreamer from those who take risk. A dreamer only dreams and stop dreaming when the going gets tough. Do you know what risk takers do? They tell their tough to keep going. Yes, risk takers tell their tough to keep going. The question is, are you a dreamer or a risk taker? Live your dream. When others go to sleep, Keep on pushing your dream. When others quit, keep going. Keep climbing the ladder of success when no one else believes in you. Everyone was born to dream. Not everyone will love to take risk. It is not enough to be a dreamer. Being a dreamer will not make you rich. Being a dreamer will not make you successful in life. It is absolutely not enough to be a dreamer because everyone was born with that thing called a dream. Bill Gates, Nelson Mandela, Steve Jobs, to mention a few, these are the risk takers. Those are men who left everything they had for their dreams. Do you want to be you? and live your dream or you want to be what your family members want you to be do you want to die leaving your legacy or you want to live trying to please everyone in life live your dream you don't need your friends to live your dream you don't need your family members to live your dream you and only you have got the power to make your dream come true only you and no one else they are dreamers who wish they could write a book? There are dreamers who wish they could do this very thing I'm doing right now. There are dreamers who spend their whole life wishing that if only I could become this or that, I would become happy. Live your dream. When you live your dream, you don't go looking for happiness. Happiness will come looking for you. When you live your dream, you don't go looking for others' approval. Others will come looking for you. When you live your dream and die, your dream will live after you. Live your dream. It's good to be a dreamer, but it's better to be a planner and a worker. A dreamer will always dream. Results don't come from dreams. Planners and workers take risks to make their own dream a reality. I am a risk taker, and I know that the only real failure in life could be not living my dream. I will not leave my dream a dream. No way on this earth.